Um, I deeply apologize for the video of me that went viral some days ago. I would... Not too sure why people are so desperate to blow on social media, they want to gain followership at all costs, then you see them engaging in all sorts of drama and cloud chasing, and this is the case of Etiosa, or Etinosa as they call her, I'm not sure what the right pronunciation is. Etiosa has always been on the news for wrong reasons. About 8 months ago, she was on MC Galazi's Instagram live show video, whereby she went naked. And a lot of people called MC Galazi out, saying that he would have stopped the video since she was drunk, she wasn't in the right sense of mind, and again that she was battling with depression as a result of her experiences in her last marriage. However, MC Galazi came out to say that two of them planned it, so it was all for cloud chasing. And last week, Etisa was seen on Instagram live video smoking while using Bible as an ashtray, and people called her out. Then after a few days, she came out to make a video saying that she is sorry while advertising an ashtray for people. Hi guys, you're watching M Chicky Series. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you for your support. I quite appreciate that. And it's good to have you around again. And if you're new to this channel, kindly consider subscribing by clicking on the red subscribe button. Also hit the bell icon, that way you get notification whenever I upload a new video. So in today's video, I'll be talking about Etiosa. She's always in the news for wrong reason, always doing awkward things. From going nude on MC Galazi's live show, to using Bible as an ashtray, who does that? Only attention seekers, only people who want to get famous at all costs, or is it called cheap popularity? Or should I even say notoriety? This is a case of Etinosa, where people want to blow on social media, they get into odd things. But anyway, I understand that Nigeria being a kind of country it is, whereby if you don't do anything abnormal, that you're not going to succeed, and people are not going to see you to be different, then you see these people trying to stage all sorts of things, go into all sorts of drama, simply to get their names out there, because they believe that no publicity is a bad publicity. I think I've heard one of the celebrities say that, I think it was Tonto Duque who said it that no publicity is bad publicity so because of that they get involved in all sorts of drama simply to get people to follow them but in all honesty this Etiosa's case is a bit surprising to me because the last time she was on MC Galazis she eventually came out to apologize about the way she was behaving saying that next time she will go live that she will not drink alcohol because last time it was alcohol that escalated the whole situation but that's the same thing that is exactly happening. She has finished her alcohol and now she is buzzing and at the same time using Bible as an ashtray while saying that Proverbs 22 verse 6 that says, Train up a child when he's young and when he's old he will not depart from it that it is a scam. That nobody should blame her mom that she has trained her and trained and trained and still training and she's still departing. <laughs> I think Etinosa is getting it all wrong. If you don't want to believe what your parents taught you or you don't want to do, like your parents advised you, then it's your own cup of tea. And moreover, leave Bible out of this. If you're tired of going to church or you have problem with your pastor, go and settle it with him. But leave Bible out of this. Some people are still Christians and will forever remain Christians. So don't belittle people's faith. You are free to belong to any religion you want because she went further to talk about Muslims, trying to talk about Quran, using Quran to do the same. And a lot of people attacked her, so having received all this pushback, Shinan came up with an apology video, which I don't consider an apology video because it has an advert attached at the end, which I didn't include in the clip, and this shows that she did all those things for clout. Um, I deeply apologize for the video of me that went viral some days ago. I would never, in my right senses, disrespect anybody's religion, beliefs, culture, etc. And to those who saw this video, please don't do it. I mean, why use the Bible as ashtray when you can get an ashtray from small... This is really annoying. She's advising people not to do it, but she has done it. And the reason why she did it is because she was chasing clout. And she will continue to chase clout because very soon another video will drop of hers doing one of those silly things. And you know what? This social media chase is an endless chase because the more followers you get, the more you are thinking how to sustain them and the more you wish to get more followers. So the chase is like a vicious circle. You keep doing all sorts of things. You keep engaging in all sorts of drama for those people that like drama. I hope she's able to find a better way to balance it because the way she's going, she's cooking a recipe of failure. There are better ways to go about being famous and if you want to gain popularity, not the way she's going about it. For those of you who have not seen her first video with MC Galaxy, I'm going to link it up here. And after the video went viral, this is what she had to say to her fans. Those things are private things. You know, your weakness should be covered 
but unfortunately for me i um i happen to be out there and uh, the people who are judging at the moment i don't really blame you guys it's fine because i put myself in the spot and i take full responsibility for the incidents and um, i should have been more responsible i should have been more careful with, with alcohol with expressing myself with whatever it is i uh, i want to do you know so it was yeah all we have to do now is ask god god for forgiveness and he's going to do you know something like that and make tell people to you know uh be you know freaky freaky <laughs> You heard her say that she should have been more responsible and she should have been more careful with alcohol. And all she has to do is to ask God for forgiveness, which shows that she is a Christian and is still the same God, whom I think that she doesn't have regard for because using Holy Bible as an ashtray says a lot about her. So this second video that is popping now shows that she's not responsible. She has not realized what she did. Like I said before, a lot of people came for MC Galaxy as regards that first video. And MC Galaxy came out also to defend himself. And this is what he has to say. I think I need to say the whole truth about this live video thing once and for all. Um, the live video thing, we planned it. Me and Etinosa actually planned that stuff. You know, but I was not happy the way the whole thing turned out to be on me alone and all that, you know. But we planned it, but we not planned so she could come over naked like that. She overdid it when she came on live video. Funny enough, the first time I've ever done a live video was on Etinosa's live. Etinosa was doing her own live video. So I now call him on her own. I, I was watching her first. She was just showing herself, doing like a video vixen. So I now call him. She now said, oh, guys, come and use me in your video. Just joking, jokingly. I mean, I said, ah, you're looking sexy. Why are you doing this? I now played a song with my own speaker server. I have, I have the video. I played a song. And she kept doing it. She kept doing it. So the views, too many views. You know, so the next thing, the phone caught. So I now started doing my own live video. I said, who can do like it, you know, sir? That was when we got the first girl that got, went naked. The whole thing went viral, you know. So when Etinosa saw that, Etinosa said, ah, ah, she called me, my guy, you don't use this thing, blow. This thing don't blow. Come on, I'm coming on live on Friday. She even posted on her, on her Insta story, ladies want to be freaky. I want to be freaky on Friday. She even dropped a comment on my page, I want to be freaky on Friday. So she now called me on a Friday. Whenever I want to go online, I should call her before I go online so that she can remember. So when I, want, when I wanted to go online, I now called her, I said, I'm about to go online. So I was very surprised when I saw her do the old acting drone that when I called her, she was like, I was surprised. You know, so when I called her, she said, okay, are you about to go online? I said, yes. She came online. She sent me a request. You know, you send me a request properly. If you don't send me a request, I can't call you. No, so she sent me a request and I accepted the request. She came on live video. So she overdone. So me, I was like, ah, why is she doing this? I, if I want to cut, she'll tell me if you cut, I will kill you. So I was like, maybe she has a reason why she want to do this. You know, everywhere scatter. I was not happy when I saw her send Mr. 2K a message and tell Mr. 2K, come and help me on MC Galas's life. It would look like as if I came to your house and asked you to do a live video. No, it doesn't make sense. You know, so even two days ago, when um, Mr. 2K got to realize that the whole thing was planned, Mr. 2K called me and apologized for posting me and insulting me. And Mr. 2K said, I'm sorry, Galaxy. We are brothers from the Niger Delta. And I said, no problem. I was never mad at you. I know, I know say, you know, Sabi said, I plan, we planned the thing. I said, but no problem. And I told him that the whole thing was planned. He was like, what? Are you serious? So you guys just had that. It's all about cloud chasing. And Etinosa is very good at this. Each time she comes up with one trick or the other just to let people follow her. And you guys know that once video goes viral, there'll be lots of people viewing it. 
And that does not necessarily mean that whatever the video is showing or talking about is good. So it's all about publicity. And according to Tonto DK, no publicity is bad publicity. And this is what Nigerian celebrities are all into. It's all about games, drama, and cloud chasing to gain followers. So let me know what you guys think about this cloud chasing. That is all over social media. People trying to gain followers by causing drama on social media. I'm going to sign off here. Stay healthy and safe. And remember to share this video with family and friends if you love it. And don't forget forget to hit that red subscribe button if you watched till this moment what are you still waiting for hit the red subscribe button and join the family and i'm gonna catch you in my next video bye